back. We're going to do one last hit right now with reporter Jeremy Chen. Jeremy, we've had panic at the strip tonight for many thinking that it was an active shooter, uh, and luckily it was not an active shooter. So what more do we know tonight? Yeah, Paulina, Metro Police obviously taking reports like these very seriously. There is a massive police presence out here, but they are tweeting that the reports of an active shooter are unfounded near the MGM Grand. There apparently was shattered glass heard, and that, of course, startled uh, people in that particular area. So as you can imagine, when you hear something like that, you're not sure whether it is actually shattered glass or actual uh, gunshots, but obviously Metro Police taking uh, reports of this extremely seriously. You can hear the sirens uh, just around me. Uh, we have a Clark County Fire Department vehicle just passing by us just behind me uh, over there. You also see a lot of uh, Metro Police vehicles. The reason why you have a lot of traffic is because you have a lot of cars over here trying to beat the light and unfortunately get stuck keeping the uh, cars in the other side of the intersection from being able to get through. So not necessarily unusual to see something like that on a Saturday night, normal Saturday night here on the Strip. But of course, all the panic, the talk of social media. But again, the reports of an active shooter unfounded, according to Las Vegas Metro Police. Reporting live, I'm Jeremy Chen. Jeremy, thank you so much. We also want to re reiterate that MGM Grand tweeted out tonight saying that MGM and all strip properties are continuing business as usual tonight. So if you are in the area, there is heavier traffic. Brace yourselves for that. And we hope that everybody stays safe tonight. Have a great night. Thanks for watching.